All right, we just heard from the judge that this was a mistrial and that the jury could not come to a unanimous decision. And Track, tell us, you are the manager for YNW Melly. What's your reaction to the mistrial? I mean, I'm, I'm happy with it, you know what I'm saying? Uh, it's not the verdict we would want, of course, but, you know, it's a second chance. And I take that literal for everything. Second chance for life, second chance for a better defense. So, you know, I'm, I'm excited. Really feel like Melly's coming home. Ben felt like that, but it's just, you know, I've confirmed it. Have you had a chance to talk to Melly since he's been during this trial and whether or not, you know, what his reaction would be to a mistrial? Um, I mean, you know, they took his phone privileges a long time ago before we even got to this case, so no. But I'm pretty sure he's he's patient, you know what I'm saying? He's going to get into his music, you know, write more, get into his praying and just because he know he's coming home. So if, if it's not today or tomorrow, it's definitely going to be soon, real soon. Have you had a chance to talk to any of the other family members since the mistrial was called, or do you know how they would feel about it? Um, no, because it just happened. So, you know, I'm, I'm pretty sure, like, everybody's feeling the same way I feel. You know, as long as it's not a guilty verdict, you know what I'm saying, it's, it's way more more ensuring than, than that. So, you know, we're pretty much just ready for the next go-around. All right, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us today. No, no problem. You have a good day. Melly coming home 2023.